Hello everyone. Welcome to Skills Build Training YouTube channel. Myself Muhammad Zubair and this channel is all about showing you how to become an IT pro really fast. So the topic of today's video is how to fix wireless adapter missing in Windows 10. So without any further ado, let's get started. When you do not see your network adapter on your computer it can be because of one of the many reasons it may be because you have an older network card driver installed on your computer or the driver is not installed or there can be any other problem but you do not have to worry if the problem is happening on the computer for the first time try to reboot your computer and check if you can discover the network adapter on your computer if the network driver is still not appearing on your computer i'll show you some of the fixes what you can apply on your system number 1 show hidden devices in device manager to do that press window plus r button and then just write dev mgmt dot msc just hit enter the device manager has just opened up the other way to open it is just press your windows key and just write here device manager both are the fine ways so do whatever you want after that click on this view button and from here click on show hidden devices here it is just click on it after that search for network adapters here it is i will just click on it and now click on action and here it is i will just click on it and now i will click on scan for hardware changes and now if i open this one here you will see your network adapter will appear here if still it doesn't appear here we have another way of solving this problem so i will just close this one number 2 automate wan auto config automating the wan auto config service on your computer will surely help you out for that we need to open our services so i will search for services here it is i will just open it and from here scroll down to the bottom and here look for wan auto config double click on it and from here check the status at the moment it is stopped so just click on start and as you can see it is running at the moment and after that check the startup type if it is manual or it is disabled if it is manual or disabled click on automatic after that just click on apply and then just click on okay your problem will be solved number 3 update the network adapter driver if you cannot discover a network adapter driver on your computer it may be because of the old or incompatible version of the network adapter is installed on your system so updating your existing driver may solve the problem to do that just open your device manager again here it is i will just open it after that come to the network adapter and from here look for your network adapter driver and after that right click on it and click on update driver and now your driver will get updated and your problem will get solved to do that just click on it and here you have two options either you can search automatically or you can browse from your computer in case if you want to go with browse my computer for drivers you must have to download your driver on your own but if you go with this option which says search automatically for drivers it will look for the particular driver on its own and it will download it and it will install it into your system and after that just close this window So that was all about it and now let's move ahead number 4 roll back network adapter driver update if the network adapter was working well some days before recent updates to your driver may be the reason you are not seeing the network adapter on your computer so one way is to roll back to the last update of your network adapter driver and it may solve the problem you are facing to do that Again open your device manager here it is i will just open it from here again go to your network adapters and i will expand it and then click on the driver which you are using into your system so i will double click on it and now go to your driver tab and from here 
you will see an option which says roll back driver but as you can see this option is not enabled at the moment because it says if the device fails after updating the driver roll back to the previously installed driver but at the moment my driver and my device is working fine that is why i'm not seeing this option after that just click on ok and you are good to go number five run system restore on your computer running a system restore from a system restore point can solve your problem to get rid of this problem just press window plus r key on your system then just write sysdm.cpl hit enter from here go to system protection tab and after clicking on it now go to system restore but at the moment i'm not using or i do not have any system restore point created in my system that is why i'm not seeing this option so if you have created your system restore point you can roll back or you can go back to that system point and you will have the older driver for your network adapter so i will just close this one and now let's move on to the last solution and that is reset winsock from cmd if any of the above fixes did not work for you resetting the winsock may help you out to do that we have to open our command prompt and we have to open it in administrative mode so i will just right click on it and i will run it as administrator now here we just need to write one command and that is net sh space winsock space reset after that just hit enter and it will reset it and your problem will get solved there is one thing which needs to be remembered and that is after applying any of the solution which is mentioned in this video you have to reboot your system so make sure after applying all these solutions reboot your system so that the changes can take effect into your system and your problem can get solved and that brings us to the end of today's video i hope you must have learned a lot of new things about how you can solve the problem related to your network adapter and if that is the case please leave a like and subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon along with it if you have something to ask please leave a comment below we will get back to you as soon as possible till the next video take care